Today we have the distinct honor of presenting and conferring two honorary degrees, a time-honored tradition in higher education that recognizes those who have sustained a lifetime of achievements that have had a profound and enduring impact to education, to culture, and the overall quality of our society. It is now my privilege to introduce Trustee Adam Day, who will extend greetings on behalf of the CSU Board of Trustees and present the first honorary degree. Trustee Day. Thank you. Thank you, President Cropper. And thank you, cadets, parents, faculty, and staff for inviting me and my colleagues to join you in this wonderful occasion. On behalf of the entire California State University Board of Trustees, we congratulate you and your families on this remarkable achievement. Of all of our duties as members of the Board of Trustees, I can assure you that none gives us more pleasure than to share in the excitement of this day and celebrate this significant milestone in your life. For every one of us on the board, today represents the focal point of our work and support for Cal Maritime. It truly is an extraordinary moment. Cal Maritime is a special place for many reasons. We take pride in the fact that everyone is welcome here who wants to work hard, contribute to the success of others, and leave the world a better place than he or she found it. This is the baseline for determining the ultimate quality of your degree. As you leave Cal Maritime today, you will join a very distinguished group of citizens of California and of the world. More than 6,500 Cal Maritime alumni and 3 million CSU alumni who precede you have gone on to positions of leadership in business, engineering, government, operations, and civic organizations. Your lives, like theirs, have undoubtedly been enriched by the experience of this great Maritime University and its mission to train, educate, and develop graduates for positions of progressively challenging leadership responsibilities in the global maritime profession. Your many future accomplishments will undoubtedly be influenced by what you have learned here, in the classroom, on the ship, and in your daily lives. I hope you remember these times and these experiences fondly and continue to be actively involved in the life of the university in the years to come. The trustees of the California State University system are very proud of your achievement and we wish you every success for the future. It is now my distinct pleasure to present today's first honorary degree. In the world of higher education, there is no more prestigious award than the granting of an honorary degree. This is not something for which you can apply. You do not get to nominate yourself. In fact, you will not know you were ever nominated until our board makes a determination confidentially. The review process is complex, lengthy, and rigorous. A nominee and their qualifications are challenged and reviewed multiple times, both at the campus with review by the faculty senate and by the chancellor's office. It is then further reviewed by a committee of trustees and ultimately by the full board. To even be considered, our criteria are very stringent. First, to recognize inspirational character, excellence, and extraordinary achievement in significant areas of human endeavor that reflect the objectives and the ideals of the California State University. Second, to honor meritorious and outstanding service to the California State University collectively or to individual campuses, the state of California, the United States of America, or to humanity at large. And third, to recognize individuals whose lives, conduct, and significant achievements serve as examples of the California State University's aspirations for its diverse student body. In short, we are extremely selective, and today we honor two such individuals who not only meet this criteria, these criteria, they truly represent the best of the best in our midst. I would now like to read the citation for our first honorary degree and ask that President Cropper and Trustee Emeritus Ralph Pesquera join me. Thank you. Come on over here. 
Ralph R. Pesquiera Jr. grew up from behind the counter of his father's restaurant business, El Indio Shops Incorporated, originally founded as a tortilla factory in 1940. He took over the family operation in 1981, and today, having provided food-ready care packages to our soldiers while fighting in Vietnam and Desert Storm, El Indio is beloved around the world. Mr. Pesquiera earned a bachelor's degree in business administration and marketing from San Diego State University in 1957. His connection to SDSU deepened when he was invited to serve as a founding member on SDSU's Campanile Foundation Board of Directors, which he served for 11 years before receiving emeritus status in 2011. Mr. Pesquiera was appointed as a member of the California State University Board of Trustees in 1988 and then reappointed in 1996. During his 16-year tenure, he chaired numerous board committees and participated on search committees for many of CSU's executive positions, bringing new and innovative leadership to the CSU system. As a longtime supporter and champion of a high-quality education, Mr. Pesquier was and continues to be a strong advocate for improving mathematics and English proficiency for incoming freshmen. His passion for helping first-generation students to be college-ready extended into the deliberation of the California Post-Secondary Education Commission, initially as a representative of the CSU Board of Trustees in 1997, then reappointed by Governor Schwarzenegger in 2006 as a representative of the general public. His long and faithful service on the commission helped establish the Early Assessment Program, a cooperative program designed to help first-generation students and those in underserved communities to the benefits of the public schools, including the CSU system and the students it serves. Mr. Pesquiera continued his work in the support of education through joining the California State University Foundation Board of Governors in 2005. He has served as vice chair of the board and chair of the advocacy and scholarship committees. He most recently funded a CSU trustee award for outstanding achievement a scholarship program for students who have demonstrated financial need and have modeled exemplary academic performance, community service, and personal accomplishments. In recognition of your long and distinguished career, your programmatic and philanthropic contributions to the advancement of higher education, and your tireless efforts to help first-generation students and those in underrepresented communities succeed in college, the Board of Trustees of the California State University are proud to confer upon you the degree of Doctor of Humane Letters. Ralph, let me come over here. Dr. Pesquera. Good afternoon. I come up here, I hear wonderful words, but I look at the most fantastic future public right here in front of me. And the one thing I say, don't give up. This world, this country, your family, your children, will depend upon you. Keep in mind what you've got today, you will need to double twice over. Please don't give up. And someday you may be right here. And I thank you so very much for being here.
Thank you, Trustee Day, and congratulations, Trustee Emeritus Cascara.